Hello everyone, Andrew Oliver here with Sound Talk on the New Fury blog, and today's topic has been on my mind a lot recently, and that is the seemingly non-existent merging of hip-hop and progressive rock music. Now this idea really went off in my head due to some of the stuff I've been listening to lately, one being Rush's track Roll the Bones, in which Getty Lee executes a couple of bold and seamless rap verses, and the other, oddly enough, being Snoop Dogg's 2011 album Dogumentary, in which Snoop masterfully adapts his trademark flow and rapping style to a number of different genres and styles on the album. And this really got me thinking about how over the years hip-hop and other genres of music have grown and expanded to meet and merge with one another, from jazz to heavy metal to pop to numerous electronic subgenres. But one genre of music in which this really hasn't taken hold is progressive music, and that's always seemed a little funny to me because for me, at least, progressive rock music has always been about progressing, expanding, and pushing musical boundaries. And Rush did touch on this with Roll the Bones. Uh, though it would be a stretch to really call that a progressive rock track, it does show how hip-hop music can work in a similar context. In general, this would be a way to sort of expand upon a genre of music that, while still being able to churn out more than capable acts, has sort of become a little bit stagnant and hit a wall when it comes to musical expansion. Rappers like CeeLo Green, Snoop Dogg, Del the Funky Homo Sapien, and MF Doom have all shown that they are more than capable of thriving in different musical environments. So why this, what I think to be a rather natural progression, hasn't occurred is a little beyond me. Um, featuring a rapper in a progressive rock track would add a whole new dimension. It would provide counterpoint to the rest of the song and even add new depth, characterization, and theatrical appeal to a concept album. However, I don't think that really the difficulty in executing this and making it successful lies within the hands of the musicians. Rather, I think the real difficulty here in the success of such a genre mashup is in the fan base, specifically the progressive rock fan base, if anything. Um, over the years, I've seen a lot of hate in you know the rock and heavy metal communities when it comes to hip hop music. Like little musical eugenicists or just snobs, they seem to really detest the idea of their their beloved, their their pure rock music being tainted by anything to do with the hip hop genre. And to be fair, this would come as a rather large shock to the fan base, and I fear that a lot of people would have trouble accepting it. Though, for me personally, uh, I'm a big fan of the idea and, and hope that there's a place for this genre mashup in the future. But what do you guys think? Is this something that you would love to hear? Something you would hate to hear? Uh, do you think it could even happen in the first place? And who would you like to see participate in such a mashup? What would you like to see me talk about in the next blog post? This is Andrew Oliver on Sound Talk with the New Fury blog.